All right, looks like they're actually going to let me play uh, Elder Scrolls Blades now, so let's check it out. I'm going to try play, playing um, vertically in portrait mode, so you can play this in either portrait or uh, landscape, but I'm interested in this this portrait mode. It's a bit different. I tap the ground to walk there. Pretty simple. Gotta get rid of myself. Like, why am I gonna be unobtrusive? Hold and move to look around. Well, it's quite pretty. It was like a gigabyte download, so you'd expect a few colorful assets. Hang on, let me get a bit of sound here. I don't usually love uh, tap to move, tap to walk kind of controls, but um, look, this is a mobile game. I don't know. Is there like a castle over there? Bloodfall Queen's business only. I'm going through one way or another. Ah, oh, we oh, I had to get into a fight, didn't I? Oh, shield up. <laughs> okay, I like that. Take a swing, shield up. One. Swing, shield up. Come on, hit me. I was a bit slow there. Finding the shield sometimes doesn't go up when I really want it to. I'm sorry. Sorry, mate. Sorry. Oh, not you too, Mercy. I'm really sorry about this. Oh, you surrender. Who are you? Your town refused to pay taxes to the Queen. We're here to collect. So you set fire to my town? Backstory. No. I don't know how that happened. Must have been an accident. Tell your queen to leave us alone. Do you really think she listens to the likes of me? What is the game wanting me to do? Strike him down? Nah, mate, you can go, you're alright. Just don't sneak up behind me and kill me or anything. <laughs> I'll just head off this way. It's all good. Ooh. So that's my town. I hope I followed that right. That's my town and it was set on fire because reasons. During combat, tap on your health bar to instantly open potions. Nice. Say, you look very familiar, aren't you? Um, oh, it's on the tip of my tongue. He's a funny looking fellow. Oh, this is me. Great, okay, here we go, guys, here we go. Who are we gonna be so we can be male we can be female let's be female today um oh races dark elf high elf nord um orc red guard wood elf argonian <laughs> yeah i think i remember a little bit of from seeing argonian in other elder scrolls games but man it's weird. What are they supposed to be, fish people or dragon people? Either way, we're definitely going Argonian. We get a plus 5% health regeneration, plus 5% damage with daggers, hand axes, and light hammers. Let's be a short Argonian. Um, hey look, I'm quite pink in the video right now. I look a bit like the Argonian. I'd like to see my body while I'm customizing it. So that's a little issue but all right let's go quite on the large side skin color let's be a bright blue argonian with a head that looks like oh these are subtle changes i don't know that one looks good hairstyle you've got hair well we've got horns let's go with these feathers on our heads that one or that one this one hair color let's color these feathers Oh, look, let's stand out with some bright purple feathers. Eyes and nose. We'll have some green eyes there. I think that works for me. Nose? <laughs> I mean, they're all... Oh, well, that one's a bit different. Let's have quite a protruding nose. I think it looks good on the Argonian. And no, I'm not just designing it to look like myself, but prominent noses, you know, pretty attractive. <laughs> okay, mouth. Again, these changes are very subtle. Oh, now we're talking. We've got some face markings. We want something that says, I mean business, but if you surrender, I'll probably let you go. And then regret it later. 
Something like that. That's a little bit alien. I like that. Oh, we can spin me round. You spin my head right round, right round. Oh, I think the black markings works for us. That's great. All right, that is that is our character customized. Now, what is your name? All I know about us so far is that we weren't very happy about our town burning down. So we're going to be called No Fire. Or, you know, in correct Argonian pronunciation, that's actually No Fire. No Fear. Which also sounds like No Fear, which just really works for us. No Fear. But of course, it's you, little No Fear. <laughs> he knows us. No one's called me little in a very long time. That's right, I'm quite on the chubby side. It's been so long. Some were convinced you were dead. I know these accents keep changing. I went out looking for adventure. He wishes he'd done that. He took an arrow to the knee, probably. <laughs> See, I get Elder Scrolls jokes. I have so many questions for you, Mr. Junius. Um, my first one is, where is everyone? People have fled. Some stayed, but were captured or killed by the mercenaries. What happened here? The Bloodfall Queen sent mercenaries to collect taxes from, uh, well, tax collectors. Things escalated. One of them had smashed down the ancient statue of the town's founder. What? Thunder? Green fire? How did that happen? Who is the Bloodfall Queen? Azoga Grabatool. Azoga Grabatool? Alright, what do you need me to do? Rescue some townsfolk from the... Goblins? Uh-oh. Healing potions? Great, thanks, mate. Best of luck to you, too, Junius. Okay, so we can start a quest by coming over here and going to quests. That makes sense. Doesn't look too hard. We've got our details, we've got our objectives. Rewards of lumber and gold? Let's get into it. Interesting, okay, so then we load up the quest like it's in an instance, I assume. Yes, this looks like an instance. The Wispy Clairvoyance Thread will show you the way when you're lost. I love a good Wispy Clairvoyance Thread. I always have one show me round, like, you know, if I have to get up at night, go to the bathroom, just get out my Wispy. What are you? Mischief. Yeah. I'm <laughs> uh, pretty good. I know. I know I am. Magical door. Where are my soldiers? Where are my good lads? There they are, but I'm distracted by this, mate. Did I get anything out of that? What? I do not like goblins. Oh, not too bad. What is that? I'd like it, please. Gold. Thanks for saving me. I think the goblin leader is... I missed the rest. I rescued one of the townsfolk, but there's someone else here. Through the door, through the door. Look at the fire. Wow, an ant just bit me. Look at the fire, though. It's all right. I just like looking at fire. Look, if I tap on my health bar, nothing happens. What is that? What is all this? You found a chest. Chest contains valuable items to upgrade your character and your town. I can upgrade my whole town with a chest. Oh, so I've got the chests like in my inventory, is that right? And I come to my chests and I've got a silver chest and I press the unlock button and this is all very classic mobile game stuff. And I get some gems and some rewards that just look shiny and... Oh, actually, I wouldn't mind a war axe. A scroll of revival? Well, oh, this is a lot of stuff. Okay, purchase things from the store. Alright, I'm seeing the mobile gamification of things now. But, let's equip this. Oh, that's what I've got. We want that fine iron war axe for sure. That is mucho mejor. Much better. Look at that. Look at that. I mean, the sword looks better, but we're going to go with the axe. We've got some potions here. Minor healing potions. We've got some some copper, some lavender. You know, who doesn't? Let's get back to our dungeon where we are. Mid search. 
um, for our other townsfolk. Not in there. Oh, we've got to go deeper. Follow the clairvoyant thread. <laughs> what the hell? Who came up with a clairvoyant thread, though? Another chest! Blimey! Well, that's... I like how we can just add it to our inventory for later, because I don't want to have to stop every two minutes to open another chest. Goblin, you are mine! I also quite like how we're quite free to roam around when we're not in combat. It actually is a fairly open kind of game. Um, get some logs or whatever, some lumber. Um, and there's lots of stuff around. So I feel quite free even though we're in an instance and it's all quite structured. And the controls seem not too bad so far. They're not stressing me out too much or anything. Not giving me motion sickness either. Some 3D mobile games do actually give me motion sickness. Like The Room, that puzzle game, I really wanted to like it, but it makes me feel ill. I just, I guess because of the relatively small screens with a lot of camera movement, but this one, this one's fairly stable. Um, even though we're in first person too. Usually um, I feel much better in third person than in first person, but this first person is feeling fairly solid and not too whacked for me. I'm a pretty sensitive person. What's that over there? How do I get that? I want some of that. Give me that. Should I be able to get through there or is there another way? <gasps> I'm a genius. I am a hero and a genius. Watch me go. <laughs> Guys, I think, I think I'm just too good at this. I think I'm just doing everything perfectly. I'm leveling up. Look at us. No fear. From level two, you can cast spells or use abilities. That's exciting. Um, choose, an, uh, choose an attribute to improve. Magicka or stamina? Magicka. We're going to be so magic. It's going to be magic as. We acquired so much gold. We're rich. I don't even know what to spend. I can't even spend anything yet and I'm rich and I'm filthy rich. One skill point. Let's spend it. What have we got? Fireball. So... Are these all open to us? No, just those first level ones. So we can get off into some pretty cool stuff, but first it's just fireball or absorb, or elemental protection, armsman, abilities, power attack, dodging strike. Okay. I want a spell, to be honest. Let's get a spell. A magical sigil appears instantly. It negates up to 31 damage directed at the caster and converts 100% of it into healing. Alright, a bit of a defensive kind of healing thing. Fireball though, tell me. Tell me. A fiery projectile deals so much damage and it explodes as well. <laughs> but everyone will pick fireball. If this was a multiplayer game, I'd pick absorb there. Um, for a bit of healing, but I, I, as far as I know, unless I'm wrong, this isn't going to be a multiplayer game. I could be wrong, I don't actually know. Um, so I'm gonna get the fireball. Because we are gonna cause some chaos. Okay, we have equipped a fireball, which is not something you can usually do in real life. That's why we play video games. Unless, if you can, you know, tell me about it down in the comments. I'd love to, um, hear more about you equip equipping fireballs just in your life. Someone's made a right mess of this dungeon. I mean, I'm not helping, am I? What is that? What is this? This is a secret. Ooh. <laughs> Don't mind if I do. I mean, despite the, um, you know, the funny mobile format, particularly in portrait mode, this is feeling very Elder Scrolls. Um, and that's... Granted, I don't know tons about Elder Scrolls, you know, um, as I said previously. I... You know, the Elder Scrolls game that I played the most, you know, it's kind of funny to say, is is ESL, Elder Scrolls Online, the, the MMO. Just because I, I love MMOs, I'll play anything that's an MMO. I assume this is not multiplayer. I would be so jazzed if it, it 
ends up being a logic player, though. This is a hardcore little goblin. Yeah, we'll find in a minute. I'm just going to go grab some stuff. This goblin has no shield. I can just hammer you in the face. <laughs> Getting the hang of this, I think. I think I just got some boots, some hide boots. Nothing gets me more excited than getting some boots at low level. Hey, townsfolk buddy! I'm Lond, by the way. See you me in town if you need that sword repaired. Oh, good lad. No fear. We did it. We, we succeeded. What does this explore button do? Oh, it just means I can uh, have a little wander back here. See what's at the end. There's not a lot. All right, how do I get out? <laughs> ah! <laughs> Complete quest. I knew that. So this is still early access, that loading menu said. You can always count on me, Junius. We need to take care of the town. In what way? The town hall. All right, if it gets us horses. <laughs> Otherwise known as horses. Horses. Let's do this. Let's build... A town hall. The guy convinced me. Hrunius or whatever, he got me. Okay, so we are actually going to build up this town around us. Which is fun and exciting, but... Oh, name it. Ha 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 ha. Choose with care, you won't be able to change your mind later. <laughs> Inflammable. Yeah, we are not having that happen again. Not having another town burn down on my watch. So many exciting rewards. Town hall complete. Okay, well, I'm excited to see what what happens next, I suppose. <laughs> we got to convince people to come back to town now. Is there anything else to build? Blacksmith can do weapons and stuff. All right, we'll help out the smithy or whatever. It's funny, I, as far as I know, in all, in most of the other Elder Scrolls games, you're at least for the beginning, just a pretty ordinary person. Um, no decorations here. Um, no one important to the world or anything like that. But here we're starting off as kind of the controller of this town. We're responsible for it. That's a big deal. I wonder if there's a map. Should I know where I'm going? This is a big place I could get lost. But there is an exclamation mark down there. Let's go to it. Hello, Lond. How are you? Did I help you rebuild the smithy? Oh, so we can put it anywhere we like when we build it, maybe. That's what he just implied. Um, new quest, Lumber Brand. So this is town. I guess this is like the hub, the quest hub and everything. Am I going to be able to visit other people's towns later on and, and chat with them? I'm not sure yet. I mean, why... Why build up your character and customise it and your town if it's not going to be multiplayer at the end in some way? Surely there's going to be some multiplayer with all of this. Anyway, we'll see. Um, let's do one more quest today. Alright, let's just do Lumber Run. Let's go for it! Alright, the pretty outdoors. I like the outdoors here. What is that? Why? Why, why would you attack me? You knew that I had an axe and I can just chop you down. You fool! Mate. Y'all animals are dumb. What is that? No way! Get away from me, you're a monster. You're half beautiful, half a monster. What are you? <laughs> Why, why does everyone want to fight? No fear, eh? I've got no fear, eh? Oh, I forgot that I could launch a fireball. I feel a mixture of happiness and sadness. I just realised the irony of 
No fear, eh? Throwing fireballs. What is that? Tell me. Honeycomb, I am delicious. I mean, honeycomb's delicious. I don't know what I'm saying. I'm getting delirious from the honeycomb, which is delicious. Okay. In other games, I like playing a um, ranged character. I'll just kind of throw a fireball from here, but um, I guess you can't do that in this game. What is this? What have I done? What did I just do? I'm worried. I found a secret again. I <laughs> love these secrets. Oh, this is a big secret. This is some kind of hut. I wonder what you guys are thinking of the um, portrait mode so far. Does it annoy you in any, any way? Do you wish we were in landscape? Oh, and let me know if you have a preference. All right. <laughs> yeah, you're on fire now, aren't you? Yeah, you are. No fear. All right, let's follow this clairvoyant thread. Gotta remember that name, clairvoyant thread. Sorry, I keep repeating it, but mate, it affects me. Now, who's this? Oh, you're the woodcutter. Oh yeah. Well, better find this guy's wife. What happened? Spriggans have gone mad. Dude just gave me his axe. He's legit. This dude is a legit nice guy. Let's see if we can equip it without any help. Um, why would I want to when I've got a fine iron war axe already equipped? Dude gave me his axe for nothing. What a waste. Oh, these are the Spriggans. I feel bad for the Spriggans. Why must we fight? I want an Elder Scrolls game that's all about just loving one another. What is that tree doing? What? It is not on the ground. Magical tree. All right. Onwards. Mate, one at a time. They do, actually, I guess with this system, they can only attack me one at a time. So, jokes on them. first health potion I had to use. I guess because I've stopped defending myself, I should do that a bit more. This one's a bit of a tricky one. Yeah. Oh, I keep accidentally hitting the wrong thing down there. I feel like this shield button is not very consistent with where it's placed. It probably is, I'm just inconsistent with what I press. We've got so much lavender, what are we going to do with all the lavender? We must smell super nice for a Dragonian. What are we again? I've forgotten our race names. Our race name. No fear. Means no fear. And no fire in our town. Our inflammable town. <laughs> Come on, mate! Get in there! Oh, I almost hit the potion again because I'm... Well, I should take the potion. I just like to not waste my resources. You fool, you should never hit me. I am, I have no fear. And I have so much fire. <gasps> all right, I was talking all big and superior and then restart, leave, revive. Well, I don't really want to restart right now, so I'm gonna use one of these revives. That'll cost me. Spriggan didn't even get a chance to heal. That's really not fair, Spriggan. I'm really sorry about that. Thanks for the lavender, though. <laughs> I smell so good. Hello, Gina. Wife of Varro. <laughs> well, your introduction tells me all I need to know. Your lumber is mine. These guys are so generous. Why? I've got so many chests. You know what I should do? You know why I've, I probably died is... I haven't even equipped any of this stuff that I've picked up. I got boots before, and I've probably got loads of stuff from chests. I have done no equipping. It was more dangerous than expected. You're right, Mr. Elder. It's raining outside. Can you hear that? That's not in the game. That's outside. That's in the real world. It's raining out there. It's quite a heavy rain, too. You take care, too, mate. All right, it's been real. What a start. 
there's so much stuff going on. Let's just see what some of these things are. We leveled up. Um, we want some more magicka. More of those gems, whatever we want them for. I'm sure very soon we'll find out we want lots of gems. Um, perks, abilities, perks. Elemental protection, tell me about it. Okay, so it makes our shield block elemental damage as well. But what's armsman? Tell me. More damage with some weapons. Let's get this elemental protection. I'd love some. Elemental protection so that we don't, you know, no fire. No fire. So we don't get set on fire. Shield. We still have equipped the best shields with the most block. What can we wear on our chest? Nothing yet. Naked. Helm? Nothing. Give me some gloves. Nothing. Boots. I know we've got boots. We've got some hide boots. <laughs> oh, there's so much to build. Can we build a smithy? Can we go for it? Build the smithy. It is constructing. Where is it? I mean, I don't know where I put it. Is there a map? All right, y'all, how about that? Um, this has been just wild. This has been a great start. I've enjoyed the, this Elder Scrolls Blades introduction. Um, play some more soon, for sure. Um, rebuild the town, rebuild the hope. See you guys.